I welcome you to this video. In this video, I'll be showing you how you can add image to your 3D model in Revit. If you look at this 3D, this is actually an image. And this is a model in place. You can use sweep to achieve this but for this particular one it is an image so i will show you how to add that image now let's jump into my revit okay so i want to add an image to, to this place just for the purpose of this training i will add an image here so what i will do is i will go to modify then go to insert and go to the curve click on the drop down and select the car type then click on create new decal give it a, a name like image click ok then here you are going to click on this button now it takes me to the folder where i save the image and this is the image i'm going to select it click open you can see this is the preview of the image and you are going to select that image and click ok okay it's not placed yet so i'm going to go to that decal now and click on the drop down at this moment i'm going to select place a decal okay and you can see you can see i have the icon to place it now if you look at it you can see the outline of the image so i can drop it now i have dropped it you can see it here it's already there then i'll click on this arrow then select it and resize it to the size i want from the angle i can resize it okay so my decal is already here let me go to the approach view I go to the approach view you can see it here so at this time i can make a model around it so i'll simply go to architecture or simply type your shortcut my shortcut for model in place is md so i select case work click ok and click ok then i'm going to select sweep or select sweep and i will select sketch part then i'll pick the plane and ensure that this button is on so that you'll be able to pick this plane so i'll pick that plane then i will sketch the outline that is the path just a rectangle okay now if you look at it now look at where this is that means we are going to view this direction 
to sketch our profile. So I will click finish edit, then edit profile. Let's view right side. Okay, this is where we are going to produce our sketch. So I'm going to select something rectangular. I can start from rectangular. And the height can be 100 mm. Press enter. And the width width can be 75 let's delete this one so that do not disturb us let the width be something like 75 Now, I want to make some little, little design just to beautify it. I'm not going to make it too complex. Just little, little design as simple as possible. Okay, let's move this to the middle. Let's move it to the middle a little bit. Okay, so let's make this one a little bit long. Uh, 15. And this one like 1 inch. That's 25. So I'm going to pick this and this. And we'll make it as simple as that, not to complex stuff. Okay. And delete this one. Let's move this to on top of this so that it will be at the edge of the image. And we can change the material to what we want. You can actually create a material for it, but I don't want to waste my time. So I'll simply select coping. You guys know how to create material. So I will click on this. Finish it. Finish model. Let's look at it in 3D. Okay. Now you see this our rim around it, but we cannot see the image yet. To see the image, click on this visual style, then change it to realistic. Wait for it to load. You can see, you can see the image. Now, if you render it now, it will show exactly the image you are seeing here so that is how you can create that kind of image in revit i hope you benefit a lot from this video if you do don't forget to give me a video testimonial thank you for watching this video in the next video i will show you guys how you can do this Right, see you in that video. Bye.